story this morning. Molly, what are you hearing? Savannah, good morning. Now, search and rescue efforts remain underway this morning, unbelievably. Chin, when one of the seals slipped and fell overboard in rough waters, now the second seal dove in to help. That is protocol, attempting to rescue the first sailor. Both disappeared in the dark water. But as of this morning, Savannah, the U.S. military is still searching for them by air, by sea. And at this time, their identities have not been made public. Savannah? Uh, we just saw on the map there, Molly, it's pretty close to the Red Sea. Is there any connection between what the SEALs were doing and the operations in the Red Sea? Yeah, Savannah, I mean, it's all in the same neighborhood. The Gulf of Aden is right off the coast of connection. The SEAL team was not part of Operation Prosperity Guardian. That's the international coalition defending against the Houthi attacks in the Red Sea. Now, National Security Council Coordinator John Kirby said yesterday, Savannah, this was a normal operation by the U.S. military in an effort to stop the flow of weapons and supplies to Yemen, where, of course, the Houthi militant group is based. Savannah. Right, Molly Hunter on that search. Thank you very much. Back over to Dylan.